In the 21st century, the real world problems that exist are interdisciplinary in nature. Today, solving many critical world challenges requires sophisticated new materials and processes that can only be discovered and developed through interactions across science and engineering disciplines. Organic electronics or printed electronics is an emerging technology. It impacts a lot of different areas that uh, have a, a deep consequence on society. Just name a few, energy, for instance, mm -hmm. uh, healthcare, mm -hmm. information technologies, mm -hmm. Uh, security, all these are, are really important. Georgia Tech likes to not only be a leader in these different areas, but also kind of contribute to, to shape that industry. Historically, electronics relied on inorganic materials such as copper or silicon. Now a new generation of technologies is emerging based on carbon-based materials, like the molecules of living things, these organic materials have some distinct advantages over inorganic semiconductors, such as low-cost production, mechanical flexibility, and environmental compatibility. Keeping up with today's demand for newer and better materials is the charge of the Center for Organic Photonics and Electronics at the Georgia Institute of Technology, where the focus is on using organic polymers and small molecules in the next generation of electronics. We actually created a strategic plan that really touched on education, research, knowledge transfer, diversity, and um, creating a global effort. The center brings together multiple expert perspectives from many disciplines across Georgia Tech's campus, including 30 faculty members from seven schools, and partners them with an international network of leading universities and corporations in this field. All of this brain power allows the center to take on research addressing some of the world's most critical challenges and produce graduates ready to provide innovative solutions. Interdisciplinary research is, is part of the DNA of Georgia Tech. When it comes to device fabrication and device measurements, those are interdisciplinary functions. So you need to have uh, some electrical engineering background, some mechanical background in order to do uh, these devices. And that's something that the center has. This is kind of a one-stop environment where uh, you have a chance to work with faculty who have expertise in all the different core areas that are needed in order to you know, go from a concept to the commercialization of a new product. Georgia Tech is uh, well positioned uh, in this area to uh, make a uh, really big impact on the research and the technology of the 21st century. Developments being made now hold promise for new products in exciting areas like telecommunications, lighting, healthcare, energy, and information technologies industries. The people of the Center for Organic Photonics and Electronics at Georgia Tech and its partners are at the forefront of making these technologies an everyday reality.